Welcome to the Aluminum AFCO Rail Series 200 Level Rail Installation Video. Please ensure to adhere to all local building codes when installing Aluminum AFCO Rail. Carefully measure the distance between posts to determine the lengths of the top and bottom rail. Subtract the measured distance from the factory length of your rails. This is the length you will need to trim. Mark your rails to evenly remove half the length from each end and cut to final dimensions. Starting with the bottom rail, firmly push the balusters into the factory installed connectors, working from one end to the other. Now position the top rail in the box. Align the balusters with the pre-cut assembly notches on the box and the corresponding top rail baluster connectors. Firmly tap the top of the rail with a rubber mallet to properly seat the balusters. Align the top edge of the AFCO tool with the top of the post and using a 5 32nd inch drill bit, pre-drill holes for the supplied saddle bracket fasteners. Mount the saddle brackets with the supplied fasteners, ensuring not to over torque the screws. Position the rail panel on the installed saddle brackets and measure the required height of your support block. Cut support block from provided 10 inch baluster material. Secure the support block connector with the supplied fastener and then firmly push the custom cut support block in the proper location. Return the rail panel onto the installed saddle brackets. Secure the top rail to the bracket with the supplied fasteners. With the deck board in place, secure from the underside of the top rail with the proper fasteners. Secure the floating bottom rail bracket by centering it with the notch on the AFCO tool. Now fasten the bracket through the angled screw bosses.